Hey friends, I'm Pastor Pastor Tan from Lighthouse Evangelism, Singapore. And I'm so glad we can do the verse of the day right now. James chapter 5, verse 16. Therefore confess your sins to each other and pray for each other so that you may be healed. The prayer of a righteous person is powerful and effective. Such a wonderful verse this is. And there's two parts to this. The first part is what we should do. And the second part of this verse is what we can expect. What should we do? Well, the Bible is clear. We must confess our sins to one another and pray alongside them. Sometimes it's so hard to really share our struggles and the pain points and the weaknesses and our iniquities. But that's the beauty of having community. We get someone that's trusted, a confidant. And as you share with that person and that person shares with you, we lay it before the throne room of God. We lay it before God and say, forgive me, help me as we confess our sins. And as we pray along that fact, the Bible says we will be healed. What kind of healing? Some of the emotional hurts and scarring, some of the psychological and mental pain that we have gone through as well. Different issues that the Lord begins to heal. That's a wonderful part. And the second part of the verse is what we can expect. The Bible is very clear that the prayer of a righteous person is effective. It's powerful. Why is that so wonderful to know? Why is that so encouraging to hear? That means that when we pray as Christians, when we seek the face of God, we can have the confidence that He hears our prayer and He's going to answer our prayer. That is such powerful news. Friends, may James 5 verse 16 be such a wonderful manifestation of God's healing and God's prayer answers in our lives as we confess our sins and pray. God bless you.